Hello everyone, today we're going to be doing a really easy draw reveal text animation that looks exactly like this, which is what we're going to be doing. So let's jump right into it to learn how to do it. So we're starting with the blank slide and we're just going to change the layout to blank so we've just got a blank canvas as our slide. Now what we're going to do is put some text in and we're just going to write text, very inventive, but obviously you can just write whatever you want. We're going to change the font color to white but before we do that we want to be able to see our text so we're going to ch change, it, change it to freestyle script gonna um, size it up using this um, font size tool let's size it up all the way here and we're going to bold it so that it looks a bit bolder I guess that's what bold does anyway so we're going to just align this center align middle and of course we're just going to um, change the text to white um, you might want to keep it as um, black while we're working, just so that we can see what we're doing. And you might want to pull it down because it's a bit not in the centre, even though it is aligned. It looks a bit better like this. So what we're going to do now is just going to go to the draw tab. If you don't have this in your PowerPoint, just click in the top right hand corner over here to learn how to get the draw tab in one minute. It's very simple. Um, and just make sure your PowerPoint's updated. So we're going to use this highlighter, and your highlighter is probably right now set to to yellow. So look, we can highlight stuff. Look, very very interesting. But that's not what we're doing today. What we do is we're going to change the highlighter to black, um, so that it's a complete black, um, like sort of. It's almost like a pen. It's just that they don't really have good tools for this. It's not really like it's paint or anything. It's just in PowerPoint as an extra feature. Um, so we're going to use that. And um, instead of um, doing what you might want to do, it, which is going like this, this um, which would work, I have done it before, uh, there's actually an easier way to do it, which is to go sideways, because you can see the thickness of the highlighter is much thicker. So you basically just want to do that downwards as much as you want, just go like that. There we go. And then what we can do is just click on the mouse tool over here, go like that, and then rotate it as much as you want, and then send to back. There we go. So we've got our highlighter in there, and what we're going to do now is just change the text to white, as we were planning on doing earlier. And we can just move this in the middle over here. This one's actually a bit more squashed, so we can just pull this out a bit and rotate it even further. So look. There we go, that looks pretty good. And if you've seen my previous video on a drawing animation, and if you haven't, it's actually really cool, so go and check that out. But um, what we're going to do is use this, we're going to do is use the same animation. So we're going to go to animation and use the replay animation. And as some people correctly pointed out in that video, you can also use the rewind animation just to like sort of do a text fade out like this, which also looks pretty cool. But we're doing a text reveal, so we're going to use the Tool. So that's it. You can spend some time using your highlighter to make it look a bit better because mine is just a bit rough because I did it quite quickly. Um, but anyway, that's how you do it. If you found this tutorial helpful, make sure to leave a comment and subscribe down below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.